Ukrainian Canadians are one of the largest ethnic groups on the Canadian prairies and as such have had a significant role in the region's social, cultural and economic development. In recognition of this contribution, members of Edmonton's Ukrainian community founded the Ukrainian Canadian Archives and Museum of Alberta, Ukama, in 1972. Ukama is dedicated to the preservation of Ukrainian Canadian heritage in Alberta and has welcomed thousands of visitors over three decades. Ukama is a not-for-profit society, consisting of a library which includes genealogical resources, museum and archives, and has been a member of Museums Alberta for more than 15 years. Ukama's library comprises more than 40,000 volumes. This collection includes rare Canadian and Ukrainian publications printed in the late 19th and early 20th centuries. The Ukama archives contain more than 5,000 photographs of some of Alberta's first Ukrainian settlers and approximately 300 maps, some dating from early 20th century Ukraine. Our museum is home to more than 2,000 artifacts. Among these are household items and textiles used and made by Ukrainian pioneers, as well as the Bible used by the first Ukrainian Greek Catholic bishop in Canada. The collection also contains several unique Ukrainian folk instruments, hundreds of art pieces of various styles and media, and Ukrainian-Canadian military memorabilia and uniforms. After 30 years in our current location on 110th Avenue, our building is functionally obsolete as a museum. In March 2003, Ukama acquired the Lodge Hotel and Brighton Block on Jasper Avenue for our new home. Both properties are municipal historic resources and are listed on the National Register of Historic Places. The Lodge Hotel and Brighton Block are located just east of 97th Street on Jasper Avenue, an area that was once Edmonton's thriving business district. This area is presently undergoing a massive revitalization project. Ukama plans to transform the Lodge Hotel and Brighton Block into a museum that preserves and interprets Ukrainian heritage while increasing the public's awareness and the museum's visibility in the community. The Alberta Eparchial Museum of the Ukrainian Catholic Women's League of Canada and the Ukrainian Folklore Centre at the University of Alberta have been invited to share this new facility. Renowned Edmonton architect firms HIP Architects and David Murray Architect will be assisting us with this project in two phases. Phase 1 will see the Lodge Hotel transformed into a museum and the Brighton Block will be transformed to accommodate future museum expansion in Phase 2. The Lodge Hotel building will contain a temporary exhibit gallery, a gift shop and coffee bar, a shipping receiving area and acquisitions cleaning and cataloging space. In addition, there will be larger exhibit spaces, a library and archives with office space and a boardroom and activity room on the fourth floor. This new space has the potential for developing a higher profile for Ukrainian heritage, for several reasons. The facility will have increased space for our current operation to create superior exhibits, programs and preservation initiatives. Centrally located near several public transit routes, the proposed facility would provide easy public access. We've projected upwards of 50,000 visitors annually to this new facility. This influx of people will contribute greatly to our local economy and to the Downtown East Revitalization Project. Funds permitting, we estimate that we will spend approximately $370,000 in annual operational expenses, which will flow directly into the local economy. The project will take approximately 38 months to complete, at an estimated $11.9 million. Okama has received three significant donations to date. $3 million from the Community Facility Enhancement Program, a Government of Alberta initiative, $3 million from the City of Edmonton, and $100,000 from Capital City Savings. Okama thanks our donors and media supporters, including the Edmonton Journal, Ukrainian News, and World FM, for their generosity. Ukama is seeking support from the Government of Canada, private and public foundations, corporations and individuals. This campaign is an opportunity to partner in a project with long-term rewards. Among the benefits of your contribution are tax receipts, public donor recognition and exclusive privileges including project updates and specialized facility use. Donations to Ukama can be made by mail, fax, phone, email or at any branch of Capital City Savings. For more information, please visit our website, www.ucama.ca. The Ukrainian Canadian Archives and Museum of Alberta. A vision of unity, strength, dedication. Our collective heritage must be preserved to be passed on to the next generation, so they too will tell the stories of our forefathers. 
be an important link in the chain. Help us to keep preserving the past into the future.